we are here today to show you with Vault how you register for the food delivery license that you need when you want to deliver with Vault. I am here already on the website and I have signed in with MeetID or NemID as you need to do in the beginning. And this is the first page that you um, that you will see when you are registering the form. What you need to be aware of before you start registering is that you can only register on your own behalf. You should only use your own information and you should only use the information name and address stated on your yellow health card, also named Sygesikringsbevis. So we are here on the first page and you can also translate the page as I think you can choose it up here in the right corner. You can also um, translate if you press this little voice over. But firstly they ask if the business does have a CVR number. Here you press no and you will only register with CPR number. So when you're registering the name of the business you should call it your own name so we call it Niels Nielsen if that is my name that is also stated on my yellow health card then they are asking what it is that you are registering you are registering your own business then you press continue here it is they are asking what it is that you want to register and you want to register that you are starting a new food delivery business. And the reason you're doing that is because you are going to be the one delivering to the end consumer. Here they're asking what kind of type of business you are. And there are some different options and you will choose option number three because you are delivering and transporting food. So choose option number three here. You can also see that they are describing like each little um, point here, but only choose number three. Then they are asking again, who is it that you are delivering the food to? And you are delivering to the final consumer or user. So you choose option number one here. Then they are asking when you want to start doing this. So here you should start uh, choose sorry <laughs> what um, what date you want to start. I'm choosing today's date because that is when I want to start. So so if you want to start in one month, you can also choose that. But I would just recommend you to choose today's date if you want to start um, right away. We continue. Then they are asking if there is any frozen goods. In, um, in your business and you press no. So choose option number three. You don't need to choose anything up here. They are just simply asking if you are open in weekend, but you don't need to state that. So I don't press that. Here they are asking what kind of business you are again. It's just a bit more detailed since there are many types of businesses and you are choosing that you are transport business. So you're num choosing number five. Please don't choose anything else. You're not an internet store, you're not a deta <laughs> detail store, you're not a butcher, you are a transport business. Here again, they're asking for all your personal information. You should not put anything up in CVR number or P number because we don't accept that. So here you choose your post number, your Viner street name, you choose what floor you live in. And if it can't find it, then you can press here and you can put everything by yourself. But as you can see, they could find my name uh, of street. Here you press your phone number, your email address, 
And it's very important here that you press and choose the email address where you are going to receive the registration form after. So if you just type in some random email, you're not going to receive the final form that you need to send to us, the one we accept. So please be aware of that. You don't need to put any EAN number, any web page. And here is the one uh, where you again need to put your name since it's the one that is the responsible for the business which is you if they want to contact you also remember to the valid phone number i'm just pressing some numbers now since we are just doing a, an example and again i'm pressing the same email again here we go press continue oh, we can see that they it didn't work We copy my phone number, make sure it's the same. And we have reached the end. Now they are saying that if you want to check your information here, you can press it here. We can press watch the information and you can see what information you have put here. Then we go back. And you, they are asking if you want to have a copy of this information. If you would like that, you press yes. And you can put your email address. And then they ask what you want to sign with. I want to sign with my MIDI day. So I press continue. It can take a little while, but just wait. Then you are going to read through all the things here that you have signed and make sure your information is correct that means that your name and your email address is matching and especially that your name is matching your yellow health card here it says go to signing this registration and you will do that if there's something you can see that is wrong then you can press down here and go back and after you have been signing, then you will receive the yellow registration form in your email address. And that is the one we need at Vault when you are going to deliver with us. So if you are not receiving that, that means that you have not followed these steps correctly. And you will need to do it again and sign up. I hope this answered all your questions and it was easy to understand. So thank you so much.